Greetings, Grey Witch here. Today we're going to do Hold Up Burton. This is a level 50 mission available from Martin. Now this mission finishes as soon as you complete the objective, so if you're going to wait out your time for the max payout, you're going to need to do it at the beginning before you start this mission up. Now what I like to do is come over here, park my car right up here underneath this little building, and then run around over here. I'm not going to go to the apartments yet. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a position and snipe out a bunch of these guys. It helps out a lot. Instead of just driving up in there, jumping out of the car and just shooting everybody with the machine guns. This works a lot easier. It takes out a lot of the guys. Helps out a lot. Plus, as a person who plays a sniper position a lot, I always look for the furthest away I can be to take out all the bad guys before I even get in there. So this is pretty much the best place I could find for a sniping position. And it helps. This is a pretty good one too because you can pretty much take out almost every person here. So we'll pull up the sniper, switch that off. All right, you got a guy right here. Now this guy is here to help you. He's with the guy that you have to escort, so don't even worry about him. Then the guy you need to escort is back there behind that wall. But all these guys in the middle right here are bad guys, and you need to kill them. So the ones you need to worry about the most are the ones right here in the front. These are the ones that can reach you with their machine guns. So take these guys out. Now they'll get a little squirrely running around in here. So if you don't want to just worry about them right yet, you don't have to. Because your guy in there will also start shooting at them and keep them occupied. So what you can do is just take out these other guys that are running around. Some of them are just standing around, completely unaware. But you can get them, and your guy will help out, drawing them out of cover, and just take out the rest of these guys. It's pretty easy. Now all you do is just switch over to your machine gun come right down off the front of this building and come right down onto the little thing right there. Now jump in your car and head across the street. And this helps out too having the car because since you did all that firing all the traffic is kind of wonky so you don't really want to be running across the street. <laughs> you get run over it sucks. So then just pull up there's the guy right there he's still hiding. Pull up right here like this. Jump out pull a machine gun. Take out these last few guys. And they should be pretty weak because the other guys pretty much should have had them taking them down pretty much by now. This last guy right there. Now he's ready and he's going to jump in his car. And all you have to do is follow him in your car. And this other guy over here you don't even have to worry about. Now what I like to do is let the guy that you have to escort get ahead of you. Just a little bit. Don't let him go too crazy. You want to tail them probably about half the distance. That way, the pursuers who are about to come after you will come after you and stay on you and not follow him. So as he gets to the top of the street, you kind of want to slow down, let them catch up to you. Because if you go too fast, you'll lose them and then they'll spawn ahead of you in another place and it just makes it a nightmare. So you really want to get them all to follow you right through this one part. So go slow. Helps to have a bulletproof car. That way you don't have to worry about it. And then once you've got them all following you, just come over here to this side of the road and pull over, take some cover, and you can take these guys out. I like this little spot right here because it gives you a pretty good alleyway. Just take them out as they get out of the cars. You can use your car as cover. That's pretty good because they'll line up right, right in this area. You can drop them pretty fast. And just wait for this last car. Guys just show up, that guy's gone. One more car showing up. And while you're doing this, the guy you're escorting, he's just steadily driving to Martin's house. So you don't even have to worry about him because all the bad guys are right here. And he'll probably end up beating you there. So you got the last guys there. And that's it. Now all you have to do is just drive to Martin's. And like I said, he will probably beat you there. And if he does, the mission will end and then you're fine. You always want to really go to Martin's house because sometimes he'll get stuck. He'll just stand there outside and won't move. So you want to head to Martin's house anyways. That way it keeps the game progressing. Because I've had him just sit there for like five minutes and just not do anything. But it does work out pretty good if you just head right there. And there we are. The mission's over. And it's pretty cake. Alright, well this is Grey Witch. I hope this video helps you out and I will see you next time. Peace!